Hello. My name is Michael Gaffetti. I am a sophomore majoring in government and international politics. At orientation in family programs and services, I am a family programs coordinator. <laughs> Hi, my name is John, and I'm a student coordinator here for the Office of Family Programs and Services. I am a sophomore public administration major, and uh, we're here to talk to you about the day in the life of a PO. A day in the life of a PO. Day in Patriot the life leader. of a PO. Patriot leader. leader. Here at Mason. Basically, how the day works, you wake up really early, but it's okay because you got your roommates with you. One of them already woke up and made some coffee. You're cool, and you take a shower. You're feeling fresh. You put the polo on. You put the name tag on. Then you walk out the door. What happens next? <laughs> so from there, you probably will walk over to the um, Civil for Fine Arts to get the day started, to set up for registration, and um, do some morning activities to get us started. And morning can, song. The morning song. You'll learn what that is as long as you apply. So do it. It's fun. So, but uh, from there, uh, you also set up for the Green and Gold Showcase. So uh, that's the thing that goes on in the Center for the Fine Arts. Has a lot of um, different people from different offices, and they're all ready to um, give information about all the great opportunities we have on Mason. If you're not doing Green and Gold, you could be doing ch 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 check in and talking to all the families and students and being like, Oh, what's your name? Where are you from? Oh, do you need a name tag? Yes, you need a name tag. Wear your name tag at all times. Every interaction goes exactly like that. No difference. It's too much. Anyways, from there, you move on to the fun activities of the day. We start off with Patriot Welcome. So uh, you will be on stage, uh, probably be on stage, welcoming everybody to the university and kind of a rundown through the day for orientation. Yeah, it is a really great time, really exhilarating. After that, you kind of split up. You know, you could be going to do things with students. You could be taking families to where they need to go. I know after that, families and I always took a quick trip into the JC. Party hard. Um, if you're a student uh, Patriot leader, you'll probably, you'll either have your first small group or um, you'll do... Lunch. Lunch, yeah. The, um, so how it works is you either you have your first small group, you have lunch, or you'll get your IDs. And um, that kind of is like the first kickoff of the day. And then um, from there, you move on and you do a lot of cool, fun stuff. Yeah, so we're going to fast forward to like, okay, now it's like 8 o'clock at night and dinner just finished. And you're like, wow, what happened? The day just kind of flew by. That's crazy. That's always how it happens. Yeah, the days kind of do go pretty fast, even though it seems as though you're going to be there for, like, ever. But the days really do go fast. There are some slow times, but there's also times when you, like, blink and it's already, like, 9 o'clock at night. And you're and having a great time. you're in the evening programming, whatever that looks like, and you're having a great time, and you're interacting with students, and you're, like, climbing rock walls and dancing. Playing volleyball. Playing volleyball and dancing. Or gaga ball. Gaga ball. If you want to play Dragon Ball who's watching this video, if so, you should comment below because we could talk about Gaga Ball. We can talk for days about Gaga Ball. All Let's right. Go. And then it's time to go to a meeting. Bye. Ah! <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so I'm going to edit this all out. All right. What? what? Okay. Listen, we all love each other as Patriot